how can we prevent breast cancer? To understand how to prevent breast cancer, we need to understand what are the risk factors of developing the disease. The risk factors can be divided into two types. One are inherent risk factors which are present within our cells which cannot be changed. And then there are other risk factors which we can easily change and try to prevent the disease. First of all, let us look at the risk factors that cannot be changed. The race, that means the Caucasian race has a much higher incidence of breast cancer than the Asian or the Indian race. The age, as I have said earlier, breast cancer is very common in India at the age of around 40 to 45 years. In the western countries, breast cancer occurs about 20 years later, about around 60 years of age. Therefore, age is another factor which we cannot change. Then is menstrual history. If a woman has started her menses at a very young age, say around 9 years of age and goes on to have the, her menses till a very late age, 50, 55. Therefore, a large fertility period, these women are more prone to developing breast cancer. The next is family history. If a person has a family history of breast cancer or for that matter ovarian cancer and that too in relatives who were young, less than 50 years of age, then this is known as a positive family history. Then these women are at an increased risk of developing breast cancer. Genetic factors. So there are some families with a family history of breast cancer, but there is no gene which is mutated or is abnormal is found in those families. But then there are families who have a genetic abnormality due to which they get more prone to developing breast cancer. The BRCA1 and the BRCA2 genes are the famous genes that were came into the limelight due to Angelina Jolie and these genes predict an 80 to 90 percent chance of a woman developing breast cancer in her lifetime. And therefore, these women have a very high risk of developing breast cancer and they need to take certain very important measures to prevent the disease. The next point is radiation. Radiation is where young girls have had excessive amount of radiation due to certain tests that have been carried out or they have given, received radiation therapy for certain cancers. This of course has become a very rare indication as of today. Having understood what are the risk factors that are not in our hands and that we cannot change, let us go to the risk factors that we actually can modify to reduce the risk of breast cancer. 